Welcome, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. My name is DJ Pingu, and welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing something a little different, or rather this morning I'm going to do something a little different. I'm going to be trying out uh, a virtual novel, and I really hope that's the proper title for what it's, yeah, virtual novel, where you have, like, make your own choices. Yes. <sighs> Why am I so nervous in front of the camera all of a sudden? All right, so let's just get right on to it. It's called Pandemic Love, and it's about, to my understanding, because I haven't played it, I'm, this is like him know, this is a game that I'm just running blindly into. Yeah, it's supposedly about finding love during a pandemic when you're all by your lonesome, and let me turn the sound on. There we go. So, I'm just going to start. I'm going to have fun with the voices, I hope. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, whoops. Oop, 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 oop. My head's going everywhere. I saw things. I saw things. In Bergamo. Bergamo? Bergamo? Berga Bloody hell. I'm skipping that. Oh. Things are never unseen. When I got on that first flight from that place, after days sleeping on the floor of the airport, Alright, for running in blindly, this is, seems good. I wanted to smile, but I couldn't. Not until I landed far away. Still. I can't unsee it. What? I thought this was... What can you not unsee? Is that even my own voice? Who, who, whose lines am I reading? Trond. <laughs> what name is Trond? <laughs> I'm sorry if someone out there is named Trond, but... No, Tr there's probably someone out there named Tron, and I, I apologize for your parents naming you that way. But Tron, is that like a regional name from like Europe or like... Not the North American continent? What? How long? Two weeks? Uh-huh. I guess I don't have much choice. Okay, Nani? <laughs> Nani? <laughs> okay, washing hands. I'm in my room. <sighs> well, I forgot how shitty my apartment is. My name is Trond. Can I can I change it, please? Still, better than living under an airport chair, I guess. Stop it. Stop thinking about it. Stop thinking. You know what? What the fuck is wrong with me? It kind of resonates on like a spiritual level for, for this penguin. So, I wouldn't choose that. Well, if I haven't figured that out by now, so I'm being quarantined for two weeks, 14 days, two weeks more. It's been months now, months of this emptiness. As I look around the room, I see old pictures from forgotten friends and family members. Faces flow by. Faces I haven't seen in sometimes years. Still, they hang on my wall. Fun times. I have mostly just slept in here, not really noticing all the stuff I've collected over the years. My head shudders. I guess the quarantine affected me faster than I expected. 
Might as well make something to eat. Not like I got anything better to do. Not like there's anything else to do. Period. Just sitting here, watching old memories fly by. Alone. Again. Whatevs. I feel that. I feel that. Okay. Story, story time with DJ Pingu. This is bad music <laughs> to tell story to. But at the beginning of quarantine, I just got in a new job. I worked there for three days, and then the place temporarily shut down. So I was alone, quarantined in my room. The only time I went out was when I was going on walks to just get the jitters out and just feel like I was doing something. And I ended up turning to Discord and making a bunch of friends there. And for a few months there, from March, March or April to December, I was a part of a community and then my own personal life choices made it so I I left the group. But I hope this guy in the story that I'm reading is able to find his Discord friends, his community, because I'll be real. Before I really got into the community on Discord, before I really made friends, I was fantasizing about stepping into traffic. Heavy traffic. And... I gotta just say, if anyone else out there ever watches this video and you ever feel the same, get help. There's someone out there willing to talk with you, willing to... They're, they're willing to reach out if you just take their hand. So, I don't know. This, this story is reminding me of bad times, but the bad times led me to here. And one of these days, I'll make a video where I, where I thank the people that gave me the inspiration and courage to uh, do this. Two of them are YouTubers, are, are VTubers. Oh, so much difficulty saying that for some reason. Anyway. Fuck it, I'll have a beer. Yeah. Who's gonna judge me? That ain't a glass, that's a pint, man. Well, you are alone, so who gives a fuck? Wow. Just as sad as I left it. I'm considering town there. English. I'm considering tearing down all the pictures from the wall, but in the end, I just leave them be. Okay. I apologize. I can't stream with my glasses on, so I'm having a hard time reading. Oh, oh boy, just dropped a bombshell there. Oh, everyone ignore that. Well. If I'm stuck here for two weeks, I might as well find something to do. Anything, really, to push away the crushing feeling of time against my mind. Oh, Trond, oh, Trond, I've been there. I'd call you my old friend, but I... Once again, apologies to anyone actually named Trond, but I would never befriend a Tron. I'd just be like, I like you, man, but your name is just like a... The fuck? I will make fun of you forever, and I don't want to be a bad person. So I'm going to be a jerk now, so I'm not a jerk for the rest of your life. Or the rest of our friendship. <sighs> I'm going off on tangents. Perhaps a hobby. You know what? When I was younger, I wanted to write a novel. Yeah, DJ Pingu, the penguin, wanted to write a novel. I wrote some poems. Uh... One of these days, I'll have to uh, read some of them. Just just take a moment and read some of my old poems. I mean, these are from a decade plus ago, so keep that in mind. And 
I might be accused of plagiarizing because it's on my old DeviantArt account, which I, I forgot the password for like five years ago. But anyways, yeah, no, I think one of these days I'll just read some of my old poetry. Put some of my spins and twists and have some fun with it. But tangent aside, I'm just going to try writing. All right. Can't wait to get started. Let's order the stuff I need. Well, I guess I got everything I need just to start writing. Though, I might write better on the balcony with a notepad. Yes, of course. Let's see. Here we go. This looks cool enough. Oh, that's cool. You just showed me Google. Apologies, Google, but you ain't cool. And only two. <laughs> that... <laughs> okay, okay, before I finish reading this. What? Okay. Two days delivery time on a notebook. A cool notebook, but a notebook. And what is my... <sighs> Hold up. Technical difficulties. Okay. Okay. I think this will be better. That'll do. So, I stand in my empty apartment, just staring out at nothing. I can hear the muffled sounds of the neighbors through the wall, almost like someone else was there, was here. I check my phone, dragging my thumb from number to number, but there's no one I can call. No one left. Maybe someone from work? No, I'm not that desperate. Not yet. So I just put it away. How should I entertain myself now? Trond, the more and more I read through this, you just sounded like a whiny bitch. Ugh. Hmm? Was that? What? What? Am I supposed to... Can I move? Across the street. Looks like someone is there. Hmm? What is she doing? Wait. <laughs> what? Ah. This might be the wrong choice, but... I'm choosing this is sad, even for me. I mean... I don't want to hype myself up too much, but I just ain't there yet. Yeah, I should probably do something else. How about some TV? I feel like I just shot myself in the foot. I should have stared right in her eyes. Well, that was depressing as fuck. Huh? Who the fuck knocks anymore? Oh, I'm actually supposed to click. Oh, damn. Ah, that hurts my knuckles. Ahem. <clears throat> hello? Oh, hello there. I'm... Silgy? Sil... Sil... I'm going to call whoever this is Sil. Hello, Seal, I guess. Hello? Are you alright in there? Um, what is going on? Who the hell are you? I'm Seal. I'd never be able to guess. No, it's hard. Get <laughs> um, my accent, I'm trying not to do my accent on this guy, so... Whew. No, it's hard guessing people's names. Um, alright. So, what's your name? My name? Oh, of course you don't have to answer. Your personal information always your own is always your own to give or keep. My never mind. Anyway, I'm Trond. Also, 
Why are you here? Oh, I'm working from home, so I'm going around doing what I can to help people. Asking if people need something from the store, you know, still sounds like an ass guy. That's pretty damn nice of your friend. Thank you. I try to do what I can, so... Are you unavailable? What? What are you talking about? Well, information of illness is a sensitive information according to GDP, huh? GDPR. What does that stand for? Oh, oh, oh. We can't just throw important information around like that. It makes me feel like this. Huh? Are you okay? Sure. How about you? I'm not sick. But you're unavailable? If that's a nice way to say quarantined. Don't really know if there are any nice ways to say that. Thanks for trying, though. You're welcome. If this turns out to be a woman, I will just cry. <laughs> so? Why are you quarantined? Uh... Uh, bad memories. Dark things crawl past me, shrieking, clawing at me, trying to drag me down. Fear, pounded fear, the like I've never felt before. I shudder, someone cries for help. I run. Trond? Hmm? You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Tell you? What? It's okay. You're not the only one being quarantined at the moment. Hmm. Are you all alone in there? Yep. You should try to call your family. That helps, I find. Hmm? Oi! Dude! Dude or do that? Stop sliding pictures under my door. I will say screw quarantine and I will stab you. I will open my door and I will stab you if you keep sliding paper underneath my door. Ah! No. DJ Pingu can't really do a mad face very well. Ah, well. Ain't really an option, but thanks. Oh! Don't worry about me. I've always managed by myself. So, do you need some shopping done? Ah, hmm. Should I make Tron a smoker? You know, nah, 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 I'm... Some other day, but thanks anyways. Okay. Some other day then. I should get going. There are a lot more doors to knock on. <laughs> Try not to get killed. I won't. God damn. I won't. Did I say that I? Uh, it's I. 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 <clears throat> I won't. Bye. Laters. Right. Now what? <sighs> apologies, apologies. Wish I could edit that out. Don't have the hardware or tech for that yet. The silence comes creeping back, slowly, slowly, filling the room, making every little noise echo. Is it time for dinner yet? According to quarantine time, would you look at that? It is. Alright. What's for dinner today? Well, I guess it'll be a sandwich. Maybe I should have taken that girl upon her offer. Ah, oh, shit, it was a girl. Well, she now speaks. Well, she now speaks like this. Hi. Just as chipper as I can get my voice without hurting myself. <laughs> that is how Syl speaks. Hi, hi. Oh, gods. All right. 
no, 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 Trunk. This will not do. That is the saddest excuse of a sandwich I have ever seen. Can you not cook for yourself? God, Strand, you're gonna die <laughs> if you make food like that. Oh, oh, going to the balcony. Let's go to the. This is a sad looking balcony. Ah, some fresh air. Just hope it's not filled with plague. Stupid joke. What's that? Huh? Trond? Is that really you? What? I didn't know we were neighbors. Um. Hey. It's Gray. Oh shit! Oh shit! I am go I'm going to be calling this person Gray because. Yeah, that's the best word is. Gray! What are you doing here? Well, I live here. Really? I didn't know. Obviously. Though, to be honest, it's a bit weird to talk to you again. Well, not just you. Most people. It's like I'm a hermit, suddenly forced to use the weird thing between my teeth again. Your... Your tongue? I feel a bit rusty and dusty. It's good to see you, friend. You sure about that? Well, yes. After ten years? Ten years? What are you... Wait a minute. Ten years? That can't be right. That'll make me... Oh, shit. There you go. You always were a bit slow on the uptake. Oh, shit. It's a long time, ten years. Almost a lifetime. Yeah, I wonder why we stopped talking. Well, you should know, I think. What do you mean? Um, it was you that stopped talking to me, not the other way around. Ah, okay, okay. Tron, Tron, my friend, my friend, my homie. I feel you. I have lost friends, and I have been delegated to the outskirts of online communities because I'm really active, and then I just disappear. And I, in the past, I didn't realize that was the reason why I was losing friends and all that other jazz, but I found that out with uh, the story I told earlier. About the... Yeah. Anyways, on with the show. Don't worry about it. I managed to survive without your bad jokes. <sighs> I'm serious. Don't worry about it, Trond. I'm going to worry about it, friend. Are you stuck in quarantine, too? Eh... You could say that. What about you? Why are you at home? All university classes are digital now. You're studying? No, I just like being without cash in a job. Funny. Was there ever any doubt? It's been a while. People change. Sometimes. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I gotta choose this. You seem about an inch taller than I remember. Oh? That's good to know. <laughs> uh, okay, this is like, okay, this is either Germanic or Eastern European language. Language. <sighs> I, that sounded really dumb. But yeah. So this is somewhere in Eastern Europe or Germany, just because I don't know what that is. And the names are probably real names, and I've insulted a lot of people with the Tron stuff. Right. Now, I might be able to ride Freefall at the 
to volley in Gronadlund? I, I think you need a few more inches for that. I see your humor hasn't changed. Still as funny? No. Um, I have to get back to studying. Alright. What do you study? Metal history? Sadly, no. I had to be born and pick a gr <laughs> Wrong voice, wrong voice. Ah. Trond is Pingu. This guy is no accent. <laughs> I had to be boring and pick a grown-up course. That sucks. Well, what's the point studying something that you already rock and roll at? So, what do you study then? Promise not to laugh. Sure. Liar. Come on, friend. Come on, great. Journalism. Smarter than me, then. You don't have to put yourself down, you know. Eh. How about you? Huh? What did you study? I don't have a degree. Oh! I never went to university. Sorry, I'm just surprised. Really? You just seemed like you would. Oh. Though, so, you started your studies later than... I thought this was still... Great. Though, you started your studies later than most. That I did. I decided to further my studies when I got tired of going from shitty job to shitty job. I feel ya, man. I feel ya, great. Always feeling like I'm replaceable. Also, the Rockstar career didn't really pan out either, so I had to find something else to do. It didn't? That's unfair. We got close, though. You did? We just lacked marketable songs, talent, a complete band, and a music industry that allows you to make a living doing music. Close, though. Close. We had fun, though. For a while, we lived the rock and roll life on a smaller, more abstinent scale. <laughs> uh, anyway, it's been fun talking again, but I have to go. It's good to be reminded that other people exist during times like these. Not really. Oh, to be honest, I'd rather do without. Other people are overrated. <laughs> Sometimes, I guess. Yeah, sometimes. I am an exception, right? Sometimes. Well... See you later, Gray. Yeah. Bye. Well, I should probably also get back to it. Whatever it is. That was interesting. Weird seeing Grey again. Haven't thought of her for ages. Why am I... You know what? I can't do a woman's voice. I apologize. I can't do a woman's voice. And Grey looked like they were just monotone. So I will try to keep my voice neutral when I'm talking. When I'm reading her lines. Other than that, I can't do a woman's voice. So you're getting DJ Pingo neutral for her. <sighs> Still. Felt good seeing her again. She looked good. Well, the wind rustles past me, almost like the breath of someone else. Someone close. Almost like I'm not standing here alone, shuddering on a balcony. I take a breath. It's getting late. How how should I end this failure of a day? You know what? I'm going to keep it up. How about a little night beer and then some shut eye? What a splendid idea, me. Let's do it. 
but there we go. I rummage through the cupboards, finding some old beers in the back. How long ago was it that I bought them? Must have been back when me and Bronya used to hang out and play some dog watch on PlayStation or Halo on Xbox. Just two kids. Shit. Has it really been that long? Whatevs. Found some beer, at least. Oh, sweet lordy. That is the spot. Time for bed and some sweet, sweet pandemic dreams. Yeah, why the hell not? Hmm? A text? What the hell is this? Hey, I... <clears throat> neutral, 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 Pingu, neutral, Pingu. Hey, I happened to find this old picture and thought you'd like to see it. Huh? What is it? You don't remember? Sorry. It's slipped down about ten years ago, or probably older. Oh, shit! We went there together, right? Yeah, we did. You probably don't remember, but there was this guy that that was being weird towards me. Remember? There were so many people pushing in around us, making it hard to move, hard to get away. Oh, yeah, I remember. You pushed him. I couldn't hear what you said, but he went away. It seemed like you needed to be reminded of um, how good you could be. Hmm. Thanks. Really. Thanks. Night. I remember. Alright, enough memories. Time for bed. Not, not me. And this is where I'm going to save. Quick save complete. Alright. Oh, 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 oh. Um, there we go. Alright, alright. That is all the time I have at the moment, so I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I'll be putting another video out this afternoon, so the one subscriber I have, be prepared. Alright, DJ Pingu is out.